RPG. Yeah, I was trying to look my chic. I had the jeans on. You know. there you and they were very talented as well. <laughs> very talented. Well, people can throw four degrees today. Well below normal for this time of the year. Normally we're about 82 degrees, so a very pleasant day for us. Tomorrow you'll have plenty of sunshine as well. And later, particularly in the overnight hours tomorrow, we are anticipating that we could be seeing some rain. Right now, 68 degrees, humidity a comfortable 49%. Good sleeping weather tonight. And as we take a look at today's highs around the country, really warm, continues to be a heat wave down in the southeast. Now let's go to Viper 3D, and I want to show you what's happening in terms of the hurricane. Let's check in on Hurricane Dean right now. Notice it is a Category 4. Winds are out of the west, gusting to 185 miles per hour. Let me break it down for you once again on the track as we move through the next couple of days. As we head on through in towards Monday, you'll notice that the system will pretty much be steering just down towards the tip of Texas. Notice the cone, though, if there is more high-pressure system that develops to the north, this will skirt a little bit further to the west. So we can't tell just at this stage whether or not it will hit the tip of Texas. However, we anticipate that there is a probability that it could dive to the west, and certainly that's what we're hoping for so that we don't see any terrific damage in portions of southern Texas. Meanwhile, we are looking at some fairly strong weather active over the Midwest. Uh, certainly folks out there will be going to sleep with some rumbles of thunder and some strong storms. Uh, for them for tonight. Now going back to our picture here locally, you'll notice that heavy cloud cover. That's what you're going to be waking up to, particularly in the morning hours, very early morning that is, but then giving way to some very pleasant weather in the afternoon. Now let's break it down for you. The reason for it, you can see again the stormy activity in the Midwest. We have two fronts, one of them a warm front and the cold front. Those will be coming together as we head into the overnight hours tomorrow after a very pleasant day. Why so nice? because we have that high pressure in place. And that will be the dominant feature as we go through the day. But look in the overnight hours as we head into early Monday morning and even in through the commute on Monday morning as well. Expect to see some rainfall. Could be heavy at times, even through Monday afternoon as well. But quite different than what we're going to be seeing tomorrow, which should be very pleasant for you. So in summary, 58 degrees tonight, mostly clear. 78, your high for tomorrow. And here's a look at your extended Wednesday. And we're into the mid-80s by the time we get towards the middle portion of the week. 70s okay. and 80s sounds good. Thank you, Abby. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Abby.